Beth, if she plans to keep this a secret, she should resist telling her business in the middle of the hospital. I'm sure Elizabeth had no idea you were hanging around listening to a private conversation. Don't make me wrong in this. I was at the hospital picking up a prescription for Morgan. I came around the corner, minding my own business, and I heard Elizabeth say that you could be the father of her baby. Okay. Okay? Okay what? Okay, you, you heard it by accident. Just leave it alone. You're going to be a father and I'm not supposed to care? No, you can care all you want. Just don't say anything to anybody, okay? Don't try to fix anything Elizabeth has enough to deal with right now. Oh, wow. Well, you know, I hope this isn't a sign of things to come. What does that mean? What does it mean? You always have a soft spot when it comes to Elizabeth. You're always buying into her whole goody-two-shoe Don't go even goody start in reaction. on Elizabeth right now, Carly. And you're proving my point. Elizabeth is married to my cousin, Lucky. Yeah, things are hard for them right now, but she had no business sleeping you, with you. You don't even know what happened. Oh, I can guess. This happened right after you saw Rick and Sam together. Your head was messed up, and she took advantage uh, of you. How is she going to take advantage? That is... What do you want? I want you okay? to be careful. I want you to be careful, and I want you to think. Don't jump to any conclusions, and don't make any promises that you're going to feel obligated to keep, okay? And you really need to think about how you're going to handle this with Sam. Because this is going to break her heart. Sam already knows about the night I spent with Elizabeth. And so far, it's only a possibility that I'm the father of her baby. Elizabeth is getting the paternity test next week. Once we get the results, you then we can just sit around sit and wait, okay? You can't do that. You need to make some decisions, Jason, because if you turn out to be the father of Elizabeth's baby, life as we know it will forever be changed. Uh, about this with Elizabeth, and you know, uh, we agree. Did you hear what you said? You said you and Elizabeth, you're not even off the baby's yours, and you're already talking like you're a family what, unit. Carly, what are you talking you about? You just said we. You said we. It's just wrong. I mean, there shouldn't be a you and Elizabeth. Why weren't you more careful, Jason? Elizabeth caught Lucky with Maxie in bed. And I had just seen Sam with Rick. We were both hurt. You know, we trust each other, we're friends, it just happened, I get it, you know? I get it, I get it. You're not allowed to ever question my sexual behavior ever again, okay? Wait, like, come on. She's a nurse. HIV positive Robin used to be your girlfriend. Why weren't you guys more careful? Did. Why didn't you use protection? We did use... Obviously, it didn't matter. This is a disaster, you know that? Well, we've We've had worse. All right, back to my original question. How are you going to deal with Sam? The only way possible. I'm going to tell her the truth. Sam and I were actually making a little progress. But with everything she's going through, she made the understandable choice to focus all her time on Alexis and her sister. She always wanted a family. And now she has one and they need her. I'm not going to ask Sam to turn her back on them, Carly. There's no reason why Sam can't stand by her family and have you in her life. Oh, my fault there is. Alexis. She manipulates every single person that walks in that room with her illness, especially Sam. So Rick gets to gloat over the fact that he slept with the woman you love. Christina and Molly, they could have Sam's undivided attention. Everyone gets what they want, Jason, except the two people who deserve it the most. That's not fair. I appreciate your support. You're always going to have my support. And you know that. I just want you to be happy. And for some reason that I don't understand, Sam gets the job done. If it turns out that Elizabeth got herself knocked yeah, up. Elizabeth didn't get herself anything. The responsibility <sighs> goes, but you know what the bottom line is here? You don't like Elizabeth. What does she expect from you? What does she want? She wants the baby to be Lucky's. Does he know about this? 
uh, he knows that she's pregnant. He knows, he thinks it's his. He has no idea we were together. He could have watched you guys doing it right in front of him and he wouldn't have seen it. Uh, so stop, day. okay? Stop right what? now. I want to answer your question so you don't go off spinning your own interpretations and, and causing a bunch of trouble, okay? <laughs> Just listen to me. If the baby is mine, Elizabeth expects nothing. Good for Elizabeth. Follow her lead and stay out of it. I can't do that. Way too loyal and responsible for your own good, you know that? What, what do you want me to do, Carly? Turn my back on my own kid? No, I want you to have a child. I want you to have a child with the right woman, and that's not I Elizabeth. I can't change what's already happened. If Elizabeth is having my kid, then... Then you and Sam are not going to get back together. Do you know how bad this is going to hurt her? Of course I know how bad it's going to hurt her. Jason, this has happened to me twice. When the man you love is having a child with another woman, it's devastating. And Sam hasn't been able to have a child of her own, so it's going to be even worse. I want... I want Sam to be okay, but at this point, no matter what I do, I end up hurting her somehow. Oh. That's not true. It doesn't mean you stop trying to reconnect. Look at me. I have taken love on over and over again with varying degrees of success and failures. But no matter how many times it disappoints me, I pick myself up, I dust myself off, and I go back in swinging. You gotta take the ride, Jason. Life isn't nearly as fun without it. You know, I'm right. You're just too jaded right now to tell me I'm right. Just, I can't turn my back on Elizabeth, Carly. Can you please, for once, think about yourself instead of doing what you think is best for everyone else? Well, I just, I just think we really need to talk about what we're going to do if, if the baby is mine. What we're going to do? Yeah, we need to be prepared. Okay, I don't know where you're going Okay, what, I, what, I'm, what, what I'm, I'm trying to say is I, I want to do the right thing if the baby is mine. I would marry you. <laughs>